Hi, I'm Mike McElroy. Welcome to the video training series for the GE Vivid 7. We're going to walk through all the basic functionality of the instrument, so you'll be able to sit down and after a few minutes of watching these videos, perform a complete exam on a patient. If there are specific areas that are not covered in the videos, refer to the user's manual that's built right into the instrument, and I'll show you how to walk through that as well. If you have any questions that are not covered in either one, feel free to give us a call at any time. So here we are on the Vivid 7. First thing we'll do is start a new exam. So we'll touch new exam. And then we can begin typing in the patient information. We'll touch lock on the keyboard. We have all caps that way. You tab through this menu. Simply hit create patient. And now it will typically bring us up to a second window where it would like the weight, height and weight. When we're done with that, we just select begin exam. Okay, after we enter the patient data, now we'll get the ECG going. So we touch physio, and now we have gain, position, ECG lead, and horizontal sweep. And there's also triggers and so forth. One of the nice things about this is it's very simple, obviously, with the ECG uh, controls. You can even adjust the position where you would like it to be on the screen. If you have a bad lead you just can't clear up, you can change the priority of the leads that you do have. And we'll turn the game back down. So we can see as we change that lead, ECG lead, it completely changes the way the waveform looks. So you can pick one that might be nicer than another. And then touch Physio again and you're back to the live scanning.